everybody, it's Bond Diesel. I'm uh, bringing you a quick and kind of loose uh, build guide today um, for my idea on a assault global event build. So here it is, and you will see something stupid on my back. It is a um, showstopper, I believe. So my idea here is a nomad build with Ninja. Savage gloves and the back uh, the chest that's uh, vigorous, assuming you're going to be running in a group. Um, so, uh, I have a pecan here with determined, which is what I think is important about the build, uh, and then brutal, and then the pecan talent. So, lots of extra ammo. I think ammo is way more important than damage um, because once the enemies are close to you, you just wipe them out with almost anything. I actually wanted a PP19, but I didn't have one that was in good enough shape. Um, and then the showstopper is really, I just want a reason to use this gun. I put Determined on it, um, and then it has Brutal, and then the showstopper talent, uh, which is kind of useless in my opinion. But I still want to use the gun. I'm sure you could use a different one. Um, I'm going to go with Nomad here um, for the Health on Kill, uh, Nomad's Resolve, and Path of Nomad, because uh, the snipers and stuff will knock you out and at least once or twice per mission that might help you out um, my big thing here is getting skill haste on the gloves um, I believe I'm trying to get skill power and skill haste basically um, when it comes to the mods I have skill haste mods and everything um, my toughness is lower than I want it to be um, I'd like a, a health roll somewhere or something like that, but for now I'm going to take what I can get. Um, with abilities, I'm going to give uh, the defib a go, because people are going to die. Um, I have uh, self-heal mods, uh, so I have almost 100,000 heal on myself, and then 140 on other people, as well as being able to pop them up. And then I'm going to give the smart cover well, a 1.3 style a go, and try to... I don't know. Do something with that. We will see. The uh, the the mobile cover was an idea, um, but but we'll see. I'm not too sure about that quite yet. Um, I also thought about doing a support station uh, with the life support, um, but for now I think I'm gonna kind of roll with this. So so that's my really really quick simple uh, assault build, um, and then. I'm going to show you something else here really quick. So the other part of my little build video here that I wanted to do had to do with uh, the builds I think I'm actually probably going to end up using. Um, on my other character here, I have a PvE build that has um, the defense, two-piece defense with a ninja, so it's three, uh, basically three-piece tack and a big chest. Um, it's got a nice... Um, M4, I've got the PvE mods on there. I'd probably switch those out maybe with uh, some skill haste mods. Um, a little M700, which again, I'd probably switch out for an LMG or a uh, shotgun possibly. Uh, the pistol with cool headed, which actually could be super useful because up close, your pistol is going to do crazy good damage. You'll be able to wipe, wipe a lot of enemies out, I, I believe, if it's anything like the PTS. On here, I have uh, cluster seekers and uh, the, the the radar turret, and uh, you know we'll see how effective those really are. You can hide them behind corners when they get close, so you can help you wipe them out. Um, again, that would all be variable. I think you could also mess around with um, with reclaimer. This one I have is kind of a PVE reclaimer um, with a with a support box. Um, you'd probably maybe switch out the pulse. Uh, you know that'd be kind of be up to you. Uh, this tactician is more for PVE. Um, and then this final measure, you know, you could even mess with this, especially since it's going to be an LMB um, focused global event with their grenade launchers and stuff. This could be useful. This is one I've actually turned into a basically like a legendary build. So it's uh, got some pretty good skill power on it and um, does okay damage. Um, but again, for this global event, that's all you, you don't really care so much about that because you, you're going to do damage no matter what. Again, probably switch out the sniper rifle for a LMG, even though that still could be useful for trying to take out um, the LMB snipers because you know they won't rush you like a lot of the other ones will. 
but you know, uh, and then that one again, it has support box and the turret. With talents, uh, I think you can mess around with talents a little bit here, um, to maybe steady hands, you know. Uh, I think tech support on one of these uh, electronic builds is still a good idea. Um, I, I don't. I think you can kind of fool around with some of this stuff. I'm just personally not really into the defense shield builds. Um, I don't think those might be quite as effective as people think they're going to be. Um, but I could be completely wrong, and uh, we will see here in about one day or so. So um, if you liked what you saw, please subscribe to the channel. Uh, check me out on Twitch. Check me out on Twitter especially. I'll put those links down in the description. That's about all I have. So I appreciate you watching the video, and I will see you next time.